Right, they're live on Facebook and on Instagram. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Right, hope everybody is well. Welcome to Continuous Car Drawings live from the mobile studio. Uh, my name's Ian from Pop Band Colour. If you're watching on Facebook on the Heritage Motor Insurance, Heritage Car Insurance Facebook page, I am going to be drawing a Opal Amanta, just connecting to the the live feed, so I can read the comments on Instagram at least. Um, hope everybody is well, um, and and yeah, so we're here and we're going to create an Opal Amanta. Uh, normally this would be on a Monday, but unfortunately I was stuck in horrendous traffic on the M25. Uh, coming back for an event on Monday, so we're doing it on Wednesday instead. So normally this would be on a Monday, uh, and we are creating uh, Heritage, Mo uh, Heritage Car Insurance customer cars um, as part of, uh, of, of a series that we're doing. So these will then be used throughout their kind of marketing and images, and I haven't done an Opal Manta yet. So this is quite exciting to do one. A nice kind of orangey, burnt orangey colour. Uh, I've got a bit, a bit of information about it as well, which is always exciting. Um, and if you haven't seen this before, so I am in a car that is converted into a mobile studio. So I go around to events, car shows and events, um, you know, like some Goodwood and Shelfly Walsh and all those kind of events. Uh, I was at British Moat Museum last night, creating continuous car drawings. So there are some examples just behind me of said drawings. So we've got number 131 in the series, which is the Sterling Moss piece that was done. And we've also got the Morgan three-wheeler, which is my three-wheeler, which is number 400. We are now up to one, over 1,000 drawings now done. So I'm just going to make sure the window's slightly ajar, so I've got a little bit of air coming in. It's quite muggy tonight. Um, and I'll probably keep the door a little bit open as well. Just to, just to kind of do, do that. So there we are. Uh, that open, that's fine. So I'm going to start drawing um, and create this Opal Manta. As I say, I've got a little bit of information about it. So this uh, Manta is owned, uh, is owned, owned the Manta for 34 years. Um, is used a family car, um, and uh, in this picture is. His daughter, who was 18 months old at the time, and is now 32. Um, it's been driving for several years and then put back on the road. Uh, in 2009, it underwent a rebuild, and the bodywork was stripped and rebuilt um, as well as new paint job. Um, and there are 90 photos of the rebuild that has been done. Because um, COVID, a bit delayed, but now it has been finished July 2021. So that's exciting. So I'm sure we'll be out at car shows and events. Um, so welcome along, everybody who's watching, hope everybody's well, and uh, and yeah, I'm going to crack on and start creating, hopefully it's also live, on the Heritage Motor Insurance, or Heritage Classic Car Insurance uh, page on Facebook as well, I believe, which is awesome, so I'll uh, just double check to make sure it is all working well. I believe it is. So there we are. Right, so I'm going to start and start creating. Uh, and if you've got any questions, either on Facebook or on Instagram, you can of course and ask them, ask away. Um, and and yeah, yes, yeah, so we are. We are. We are now live on there as well. Brilliant. Um, so feel feel free to ask any questions you like. I can see them on Instagram, particularly. Um, so you can ask if you like. Uh, yes, I've got that email, so we'll sort out that. Do not worry, chap. I've been a little bit busy at shows, um, so yeah, just catching up on all the orders and whatnot. So we'll definitely sort out that um, for your green Porsche. Um, right, Opal Manta, we'll start creating now. Continuous car drawings is um, how it works is I put the pen down, I draw the entire outline without taking the pen off the paper. Uh, have I had a haircut uh, last week, I think? 
Yeah, it was last week. I can't remember. All these weeks blur into one when I'm on the road. Um, so, I say, the entire outline is done without taking the pen off the paper. And I will now kind of crack on and do it. Um, and this is, as I say, over a thousand have now been produced. So this is, you know, into the thousand, over a thousandth drawing. So, Manta, here we go. Uh, crack on. So, uh, interestingly enough, I have got a Vauxhall Chevette being restored at the moment. And the Chevettes tend to have the Manta rear axle as their upgrade part. So... I'm going to ask. I'm going to find out if I can get hold of a Manta part because the uh, the upgrade for the Chevette when we put the MX-5 engine is a Manta B axle, which I don't know if this is Manta B, but I know it's a Manta. So it's an Opal rather than a Vauxhall. So I presume it's a European import of sorts, but it is definitely right-hand drive. So it must uh, there must be some kind of history behind why it's an Opal rather than a, a Vauxhall. Um, so, hope everybody is well this evening. I say it's been a busy few days. I was down at the, uh, uh, I was down in Kent over the weekend for the uh, uh, Sniff and Smith or uh, you know uh, Johnny Carpervert, Johnny Smith did a live event down in Kent, which was super. Really enjoyed doing that. So. Um, that was a that was a fun night. He's got another one in uh, Nottingham relatively soon. See if you can check out check out details of that. It's well worth going if you uh, fancy it. It's kind of a car show, kind of a podcast. It's a good thing. So I enjoyed uh, attending there and creating down there over the weekend. You can see photos, but on my Instagram of uh, what I was doing down there for the uh, over the weekend. Did his charger and did a few other vehicles as well. And um, just did a bonnet line now. So it's all we're doing one line without taking the pen off the paper. So the aim is to, to get that initial outline and then I rework the image in. And work into it and this is kind of say so it's got like a ready orange ready orange tinge to the colouring oh my wife's on right phone you're live on the internet there we are so there we are just gonna do that and I get the front bumper in um so, next up, I'm also going to be at an event in the Cotswolds over the weekend, just on Saturday as well. So that's going to be exciting. And I'm at the British uh, Motor Show down at Farnborough next weekend as well. So, if you're at either of them, come and say hi. I'm doing commissions. I've got a bit of a backlog of commissions to get done as well, which is always, always exciting. But... Um, it's good to have more and they, uh, they can be done to order and obviously these are heritage insurance heritage car insurance customers that I'm doing so do try to get at least one done a week to kind of build up a catalogue of images that will uh, be part of their uh, marketing campaign so if you're a heritage car insurance uh, customer you can get involved draw your uh, draw your car it's nice to get some classics done uh, is the drawing I've done something before the pandemic no um, I was I paint so I'm a I am a painter normally oh, I still do that but this is what I've been doing throughout lockdown um, is the drawings and then we converted the car halfway through or you know between between the end of lockdown one and two we converted the car into a mobile car studio so that's where the car studio idea came from so I was doing these in the house originally um, 
during lockdown one, when we all kind of didn't really know what was going on, um, and it just became a thing. So we, you know, now there's over a thousand drawings and various things that are produced from it as well. So you can head out in the shop and see what I've been doing. And I try and do these, you know, I do do them live as and when I can, if, uh, if I can, in terms of online, and but I do do presents and gifts, so I do do some offline as well. Well, there we are, there's the initial outline of the of the mantar. Welcome on Aston Workshop as well. So the manta has started, so started up here, signature down here, so we always finish up down with signature, and now to add in the colour and create the car. Um, uh, how long do they take? Uh, the drawings take about an hour to do. About an hour, an hour and a half, that's how long they take to do, depending on the on the image, but generally it's about an hour, an hour and a half. That's because um, I, that's what I, I like to, I like that kind of time scale to them. So, you know, it's very important to me is they're not, you know, not hours and hours and hours. Some are, are more detailed than others. Some have text in them, um, like this one that was done yesterday. So that was done for, for uh, so some have a bit more text and figures and stuff in them. Generally, they are done as the car. But they can have. So it is uh, Miss Katia. Welcome along. Hope you're well. Joining on Instagram as well. I can I can see the Instagram chat at least. So so if you're on Instagram, I can say hi. And if you've got any questions, feel free to ask. Uh, modified A4 cabby. I probably think that's from uh, Ethan. Hey man. Hey back. Hey back at you. Um, hope you're well. Um, and normally uh, I'm also able to do a chat whilst talking to the owners so uh, this owner isn't on socials so so it's a matter of uh, I would normally chat to the owner of the car to find out about the uh, how they how they, you know, how they got into it the ownership of it the story behind it and that's what we really want to do with uh, with heritage is find out those stories and you know, rather, you know it's a lovely drawing but it's also about the ownership of these vehicles as well. Um, so, as I say, I do commissions, I do what's to order, so if you want to have a chat, talk about your car, then uh, yeah, we can we can do that, if you if you so wish. So get in touch, drop me a DM, and you can own your own vehicle as an original drawing as well. Um, as I say, for 15 years I painted with Radio control cars. Nice to meet at the uh, Late Boat Show at the weekend, Johnny's nephew. Ah, Ethan, you were a legend, mate. Ethan was a lovely, lovely guy, proper, worked his socks off over the weekend. Um, so, Ethan, you are a proper, proper legend. Really nice. I really enjoyed it. It was really cool to, um, I enjoy loading, unloading cars from transporters. It's a weird thing I quite like. Um, always have. I always enjoy, you know, even at big shows, watching cars being unloaded is, I don't know what it is. I'm just kind of, you know, just always quite enjoyed seeing cars getting unloaded from from, uh, from transporters. So, and Pete Howe's joined, Donna has joined, welcome along. Um, so, just getting this Manta done now, this kind of ready orange Manta. Um, so, if you've got any questions, feel free to ask. I can pick up the chat on Instagram at least so that's what I can see on screen if you're watching on Facebook you can also ask and the the, the, the guy the, uh, the, the folk at Heritage will pass on your message if you so wish to uh, uh, so the extra it keeps pausing okay I'll put it onto the Welcome along on oh 13 watching on the heritage heritage page. Right, hopefully it's now unpaused. Apparently my post office parcel failed failed to, to come through. So hopefully 
is now unpaused itself. Sorry about the insta pause there. It was a message saying that a parcel had not been, had unsuccessfully been sent. So hopefully, if those watching on Instagram, you can now let me know. You can, uh, you can uh, let me know that hopefully it's now unpaused. Fingers crossed. Um, Apologies for the slight pause there. Hopefully it's now live. All working, brilliant. Thank you very much. Yeah, it was a, a parcel hasn't been delivered. So there we are, never mind. I'll find out what it is later. Um, right, so, cracking on. Um, and so it's doing great, great this Manta. At the moment I am ha having a Chevette rebuilt, so it's always nice to create an Opal, Vauxhall, Manta. Uh, and that mine is a 1977 uh, Vauxhall Chevette, which has been for a full rest though. It's a ground up rebuild, take a bit of time, but uh, hopefully there'll be a bit of a bit of a story when that uh, when that starts. Uh, <laughs> it could yeah, it could be some more pens, possibly. No, it's um. Just getting that in. So uh, I say, great to have Ethan on from the Late Break Show live. That was, that was good. I say uh, I'm in Cotswolds this weekend at the oh no, it was a Broad Broadway Broadway Car Show, and then the British Motor Show next weekend at Farnborough. So if you're either of those events, come say hi. Um, that's where I'll be, I'll be creating at least. So, yeah, doing in the uh, in this mobile car studio, along with all the merch that comes along with me as well. So, um, and then over the next, uh, yeah, going to plan some on-site drawings as well. So, going to go to some businesses and create um, next. There's a couple of other events coming up. Can't can't remember if we can talk about them all yet, so I won't say them all. Hi Ethan, how you doing, mate? And um, all right, so so just doing that. All right now, so we're, we're just kind of put down a base colour and then work up the colours into it so you start building up the the uh, the different layers and different colours of the of the of the car so you try and get a base colour in and then work the shape and uh, and whatnot so it's kind of if it looks a little bit random it is planned don't don't worry there is a there is a plan to it work well, wrong lotus super fan well, wrong Hope you will. I'll say if you want to say hi in the in the comments, and I can read them out. Uh, do I have a favourite event to create at? Uh, I've always enjoyed British Grand Prix when I'm painting. Uh, Goodwood has been amazing. Uh, I've, done, I've done what else I've done? Uh, Le Mans was brilliant. Loved that for you. Did that for two years running. Um, I did the, the last of the. British motor shows, or the, where, yeah, they're kind of the, in the London motor show, in kind of the old school. Um, there's been some really good events over the time, yeah, there's been various ones, been up, down at Bewley, been down at uh, Haynes Manuals Museum, and yeah, sometimes though, the, the small stuff is also really fun, so the small events are, are fun as well, because it's kind of... Bit more relaxed and a bit more less less pressure sometimes yeah but yeah goodwood british grand prix that's one of the highlights of the year i'd say um depending on where i'm where i'm at really and what and uh and what's being created 
we do dealer events as well. So creating dealerships. Which would be fun. And um I enjoy creating people's cars, like yeah, creating people's passions is what I particularly enjoy as well. Oh A7 ESK. It does like absolutely you're right. Normally when you'll bring them mate as well. Yeah, when you're when the coffees that are that have been purchased on on your tab, absolutely, that's Mr. Eddie King, who's a talented disc jockey. Uh, Lotus owner as well, so he owns a Lotus and a Vora. Yeah, Vora. He just changed it. And he was drawing like number. Well, I want to say under a hundred or just over a hundred, hundred and twenty or something like that. So I've done quite a few drawings since Eddie's. Chris Hughes. Oh, Chris Hughes. Yes, Chris Hughes is. Um, well, Chris Hughes uh, owns a very nice Peugeot GTI. Um, he is also marketing for the Peugeot Group, um, and uh, yeah, we did a, did a live with him, chatted with him. He also is involved with the Zoom Zoomers, which is a certain idea on a Monday Monday night, uh, first Monday of the month. First Monday, yeah, first month. Left, uh, so yeah, Chris is a nice nice chap. Chris, uh, he's always a uh, very chatty fellow, but as I say, two or five GTI owner. So uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's well worth seeing his what he what he's doing, and uh, very, it's very in, very in good condition. It, uh, it wins awards and stuff. Um, so he's sorry he had to. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the M25, not my friend. It was not my friend. I see it as a, as my car is branded, I see it as marketing. I had to put it down as marketing, but lots of people equally in the same queue as me um, saw the car. So I'm just going to say it's marketing. That was the bonus of being sat on the M25 for many hours. Many, many hours. But you know, it's fine. Got home eventually. Eventually, he says. Uh, this is Bora 400 Hethel Edition Limited 15 in Essex Blue, uh, 50th Lotus Anniversary. Uh, the runner ends you find best to use for your drawings. Uh, I use Poskas for highlights and I use Pro Markers. Uh, I'm using a bit of everything really, Sharpie to start. Um, so, yeah, so just a bit. Mm, but I found that kids. Um, Kids clean up what Poscas are, or they've used Poscas at school because the amount of kids I get at events get Poscas, I love Poscas, so many Posca pens. Um, I'm not, uh, yeah, I, I just, uh, I use the brand. I'm not, yeah, there's no association with me with, with the brand, it's just that I use the brand. So other pens are available, I'm sure, that do a similar thing, but that's what I, that's what I use. So, and yes, it is the, the uh, Hethel, Hethel edition. So, so you've got any other questions? Yeah, you can be anything about what, what I'm doing, what's next. Feel free to ask away, and I'll uh, either I'll be I can I can read them on the Instagram feed. So, if you are tuned in by Instagram, or if you're tuning in on Facebook, for the next uh, for a bit. Maybe yeah, if you're having a bit of dinner. The tea, tea, that depends what we call it. Some people call it dinner, some people call it tea. Confusing my wife because I call it tea, being from the Midlands, I call it tea. What, what do you call it? If uh, old Zed Cars, welcome along with your, your Datsun. Oh, that reminds me, I need to uh, order your mug. So that does remind me, I've got your mug to order. That's tomorrow's job, is to order all the mugs that have been ordered in the last few years. Uh, Last few weeks, so I'll uh, get that done. Good to see you at the Silverstone Classic the other, uh, the other, the other week. You had your car on display with the the Z Owners Club, the Zs. That's what they call themselves, I think.
grey in there, just the highlight of the grey and the, you know, the alloys and hubcaps. So this is the Opal Manta, which has got a nice history, yeah, fully restored recently. So I'm sure it'll be seen at shows and, and whatnot in the in the future. Lovingly put that together to original original spec. I'm not taking my Chevette back to original spec. I'm, uh, I'm putting an MX-5 engine into it because, because I can. So that's the, that is the plan with it. Um, there's the owner, Pride and Joy. Good. Yeah, it's cracking. It looks lovely. So, yeah, that, that, it certainly looks looks like it's well loved, and uh, having uh, having been extensively rebuilt, and uh, that's, that's what it's about. This is what these drawing sessions are about: is creating pride and joys and chatting to the owners and talking. Yeah, you know, and creating them. So I haven't done a manta yet. As after a, a thousand drawings, it's nice to do a you know do another voxel. Hasn't been that many voxels done, so. Be an Astra of the Mushavet. So that's what it's about. Welcome along, a Limona and Archie as well. I do need to get some new glasses to improve my uh, my reading. Oh, and good luck to those with their GCSEs tomorrow. So. I mean, I only got. To, I mean, I, I did. I did well in art, but that's about it. Yeah, you know, just uh, yeah. Don't worry. Yeah, you can. You know, I was a barman for a bit. I was a teacher. I worked at retail for a bit. I did all kinds of stuff before going full time as an artist. So, you know, it's not. It's a career path, as it were. So, good luck to those who are awaiting their results tomorrow. I'm sure. Yeah. Added there. So, if you've got any other questions, feel free to ask. Just working in there. The details now. Uh, don't ask about. Uh, are some cars more challenging to draw than others, and what makes them a challenge? Um, yes, some are more than others. Um, some like old school stuff, like E types and Cobras, and you can really see the how they were designed. Like they're really kind of curvy, and you can follow the line, and it really. You see, you can see the design of the car, if that makes sense. Some of the new stuff is quite angular and quite. There's a lot of fiddly bits on it, but that's new cars for you with vents and whatnot. Um, I I've been really enjoyed the chats that I've had with a lot of people. So when I first started doing, it, we just did it, and then I started chatting with people from 200 onwards. So that kind of conversation about it and learning more about it, whether it's a race driver or a classic car owner that is what I really enjoy um, but I also enjoy just doing it as a live as a live thing and getting people's interaction back so um, so yeah I, I, I enjoy drawing whatever I, I really don't mind because that's what's that's what's nice about this series is there's now over a thousand and there's very few repeats um, and I can create people's pride and joy so that's hopefully that answers that question in a in a roundabout way. In a roundabout way. So So, so hopefully there'll be there'll be some joints live, so if uh, if the uh, if you are do, you know, get in touch with Heritage and find out how to get involved and then uh, you can have a chat whilst I draw your, your car if you're part of the 
the series. There's going to be a, a whole range of these done. I know they're selecting, and people have been uh, putting their their car in to be to be selected as part of it. So I know there's a beetle as well. That's that's going to be one of them. I haven't seen the rest of them yet. So. And then once we've got this, we can then do t-shirts and mugs and all the different types of merchandise as well. So that's, there's loads of stuff that we end up doing with, uh, with these images. Uh, so drawings are 75 pounds to do. As, as drawings, uh, these are part of the heritage ones. So these are customers who are heritage insurance customers, and I'm doing their car as part of the, yeah. They're uh, they've applied to be part of the series, so and they'll be getting some goodies as a thank you for being part of it as well. Which is pretty cool. A unique gift to have your so just adding the colours in. Spoiler in with some splitter. Oh, Catherine from Jilks, welcome along. Hope you're well. Good to see you yesterday at, uh, at Gaydon. Hope you're well and had a good day. If you, if you haven't gone, go to Jilks Cafe over in, um, in Warwickshire Way. Um, if you're a car person, if you like your classics, definitely go over to Jilks. Um, well worth a visit. Uh, yeah, so the customers who take part in this get their the original drawing, a mug and a t-shirt with it on. So that's all part of the uh, old part of it, really. That's, uh, that's the, 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 what we're doing. Let's make sure to pull it in as well. Same. So it's kind of a ready, ready orange on this, uh, on this manta. So uh, I've done the heritage logo, so that's, you can see that back on my Insta as well, or on my Facebook page. Pop band colour it is pop band colour on all of the socials. You can see what I've been up to recently, some of the things and events I've been at, lots of travelling recently. So. Any other questions, feel free to ask. And, uh, right, so. And then the Posca pens, just to add the highlights once again.
headlight in. So you can re-watch the Instagram live, it's on the Heritage Facebook page as well, Heritage Car Insurance Facebook page, from a slightly different angle, yeah, a slightly different angle of the, of the creation. And uh, so I'm just going to have that side bit in there as well. So add a bit of a detail around the wing mirror. Looks like it's got a bit of a red interior as well. So it's going to add that bit of detail. It's like a dark red, it looks like. So nearly done. So as I say, normally this will be on a Monday night at seven. Uh, it's just that, of course, I was stuck in traffic, so wasn't able to uh, to do it this Monday. But we'll so we go. Opal badge on the front to add, and we'll go from there. So, thank you very much for watching. I say, uh, these are called continuous car drawings, um, so you can kind of see the series. We're now over a thousand into the series, so you can look at through the ones I've done, check them out on the pop and color shop.com. And there's going to be an, uh, a whole series done with Heritage as well. So have a, you know, keep it on their socials of when they're happening and how to get involved in those as well. Because you get the original, you get a mug, you get a tea of it as well. So, pretty much there. And uh, thanks very much for watching. And uh, hope you enjoy. You can, uh, I say, get in touch with Heritage, or you know, if you're a Heritage customer, you can uh, apply to have your vehicle done. And if you're on the socials, you can actually chat whilst with me whilst we. Uh, whilst I do it, so that's always a nice thing to find out more about the car and talk about car history and what you own and you'll see on my social that I'm actually in a car creating so you can see those photos on my Instagram that I posted before I started doing the live Is the Epole that has been done. And if uh, you haven't had your dinner or your tea yet, enjoy your, enjoy your, your evening, whatever you get up to. And uh, you can see loads of stuff on the Pop and Colour feeds on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. I dabble with, uh, with other things, you know, TikTok and whatnot, but not hugely. Absolutely, car with a car. The mobile car that gets car shows. So all the cars. Right, so this is the first of the thing in the series. There's gonna be more. So 
on the plating. Next Monday, drawing a beetle. Yep, that's the plan. A beetle is next Monday. So, there we are. Thanks for watching on the socials. I say, to find out more, get in touch with Heritage or... And, uh, I'll uh, finish this off now with a bit of highlights. And there is the mentor. It's just got a bit of a highlight there. Yeah, it's got the door handle just there as well. There we are. There is the restored Manta that is that has been done as a continuous car drawing this evening for the Heritage Car Insurance series. You can hopefully you see it on there as well. There it is. Right, see you all later. Thanks for watching.